Hey guys, welcome to my channel. In this video, I am sharing a quick and easy curd rice recipe, which is also known with many other names like Dadojnam or Tayar Sadam in different languages. This is one of the main rice dish offered as prasadam during festivals. So let me show you how I prepare it. But before I start, a small request, please subscribe to my channel to support me. I have taken around 1 cup of cooked rice. Here I am taking freshly cooked rice. It's just a normal rice like how we prepare daily. Add a teaspoon of salt and by using back of the spoon, mash the rice gently. And always use freshly prepared rice as it's easy to mash it. Keep mashing until the rice grains break down and turns mushy. I'm adding half cup of water to reduce the temperature of the rice as it's still warm. Now add curd or yogurt. Make sure it's plain natural set ones, not the flavored ones. Around one cup I'm adding here. Mix well until everything is well combined. If your curd is little sour, then you can add half cup of milk instead of water. Just before tempering, add quarter teaspoon of dry ginger powder on top of the curd rice and then later add that hot tempering. This way, the powder won't get burnt. I'm also adding dried curry leaves here, but if you have the fresh ones, add in the hot oil while tempering. Heating a small pan on medium flame and adding a tablespoon of oil. Once the oil is hot, add half teaspoon of mustard seeds let them splutter and then add half teaspoon of urad dal, half teaspoon of cumin seeds and one dried red chilli. If oil gets too hot, reduce the flame to low. Now add one slitted green chilli and if you are using fresh curry leaves, use it at this stage. Saute everything for a couple of seconds and then turn off the flame and pour it on curd rice. Mix well until everything is well combined. If you think the rice is slightly thick, then add 2 more spoons of yogurt and mix well. Delicious curd rice is all ready. Make sure to refrigerate it before serving. So it's that simple to make curd rice. This step is completely optional. Usually before serving, I add some grated carrot on top along with some chopped coriander leaves. Some people also use pomegranate seeds for garnishing but I prefer carrot and coriander. It really tastes amazing. Do give it a try and I'm sure you will like it. I hope you like today's quick and simple curd rice recipe. If so, Please hit the like button and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. See you all in my next video. Until then, bye.